<laughs> this is Serial Killer on the take, yo! <laughs> this is K-R-A-Z-I, Crazy! Watch out, folks, watch out! Serial Killer on the take, yo! We're going up in here to Japanese cuisine and sushi bar, nom nom nom. We're gonna do a review for Wagaya! <laughs> Come on with us, folks, it's rainy day in Georgia. Wagaya! This is the miso soup. A little bit of uh, scallions, green onions, I mean, and looks like some seaweed and tofu. We're gonna give it a shot. Salty and tastes like chicken broth. Doesn't have any fish in it. It's a little earth tones, maybe, maybe even some mushroom flavors, although I don't see any mushrooms. The scallions dominate. Ooh, it's hot. Thank you. Looks like dishwater. Like you wash your dishes in it after. This is the Eco Gex. The e Eco Gesso. Eco Gesso is. Japanese for fried squid. Here in America we call it calamari. These are just the legs. They don't have any seasoning on it other than a slight breading. Look at that, it smells delicious. Very chewy. It's way overdone. It's like chewing up rubber bands. And they just serve mayonnaise with it. And a little bit of lettuce. Or cabbage. Wow. What a disappointment. I love calamari. But this is, uh... I mean, it's gotta be cooked two minutes too long. It's just like... This is like me chewing a rubber band. What a disappointment. From zero to five napkins, this is a zero. This is the first zero I've ever given. What a shame. This is the pork gyoza. Pork gyoza. That's very tender. It's got a lot of things going on here. You definitely taste the pork immediately. And the rice noodle that is wrapped in, the rice wrap for the pork gyoza, which is called, you know, they're fried, they're pot stickers or dumplings. I'm gonna eat another one. It's unusual for this place to not have any dressings where you can add your own mixtures of uh, soy sauce or whatever. No, we don't want that. That's disgusting. The Nigeria, the sushi, and the sashimi that we ordered, the plate had tuna, salmon, yellowtail, red snapper, fluke, albacore tuna, mackerel, sweet shrimp, octopus, and freshwater eel. They were all on little piles of, of rice. And the rice was so overcooked, it was just like a messy pate of paste. It was so fishy that you could smell it coming from a mile away. I, I was so disappointed in this. One of my favorite foods is sushi and sashimi. But this place, the, it looked delicious. Uh, it smelled horrible. The textures and flavors were unbelievably bad. I can't get over how, I've never ever given a restaurant a zero napkin out of five. I didn't even have it ranked as a zero. There was never any ranking called zero. 
so it was always one through four. Very seldom get a five anywhere. But man, these people got zero for the first time. I'm, I'm almost ashamed to put this out, but I gotta let you know. Just experienced the worst sushi I've ever had in my life. It was just terrible. Right here at this place here, it's by far the worst food. Really nice people, but it was slimy. It's clearly old fish. It's just, it was so fishy and so terrible. It was just unbelievable bad. I don't give bad reviews either, and I love sushi, so it takes a lot for me to get upset about this, but damn, I just ate a $30 plate that we did not get on camera. We were supposed to, but the camera messed up. So now I'm out here, ah, it's just terrible. <laughs> Holy mother of pearl, y'all. I got sick as soon as I got off camera. I just hurled right in front of the front window. All $30 of that plate just banging off the walls over there for everybody to enjoy. It was awesome. I have never experienced this before in my life. This is on every campus. Oh my God, I can't believe it. This place was rank, like a stank foot rank. Oh my God. I've been sickened before. I've been poisoned from restaurants before where it lasted for days. But man, this place, I've never had a zero ranking. It's always been one through five napkins. But man, there is a zero ranking now. This place ranks zero because it is rank. I hope they can't be this way every day. Uh, this has to be a fluke. I would hope so, because their fluke sucked. Anyway, man, I'm sorry about this, but this place is a zero. And the worst part about it, it's right here on the Emory campus, the prestigious Emory Hospital School. And I, I mean, I, 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 you know, these people have educated palates, not just minds. So I don't know how this place could stay open if they serve food like this to everybody. Thank God the staff was cool. Man, they gave us our meal for free. I mean, I gave it right back to them after I was done, right on the deck in front of all their client time customers. It was, it was foul. I, I, I'm just going to say it's a zero. People were really nice and sweet and understanding, but man, oh man, please pay attention to your surroundings. You never know what's going to come up on you. Look out for deer and I love you. I love all you. <laughs> this is Serial Jiller on the take. Yo! <laughs> Nice! Booyah! <laughs>